hi and welcome back to my channel so spring has officially hit summer i just been to prague where i saw a reaction with dimash kuda bergen it was absolutely amazing and i will upload a vlog by the end of this week showing the highlights from that trip and concert and so today we have some more delicious recommendations for my from my patrons and the first one is Mark Mattel. This is my second reaction to him because he's like the, I don't know, you know, <laughs> if he's channeling um, the uh, the good old master uh, of Queen because his voice sounds so much like Freddy. If you haven't already seen him, you would definitely be impressed by this. This is his cover of Bohemian Rhapsody. And I'm just so excited because I was literally mind blown when I watched the first video. I just didn't see it coming. And I have honestly never heard anyone has a voice, have a voice like uh, Freddie Mercury before I watched this gent. Also, what funny, what's funny is that Joshua, who recommended me this uh, song, and thank you Joshua for doing that and for supporting Patreon, uh, he actually also shared that Mark didn't, um, you know, know that uh, until people start comparing him to Freddy and he was like, okay, and he checked up on it and he realized that <laughs> There was something about it, which makes it even more amazing. I would love loved to have seen Mark's face when he heard Freddy's voice um, So yeah, if you also want to join the patreon and join the fun support the channel and recommend some songs You should definitely join by clicking the link in the description and that said I think we should just start Here we go Okay, Bohemian Rhapsody, take one. Not really. Warts and all. Is this the real life? Is this just fantasy? Caught in a landslide, no escape from reality. Open your eyes, look up to the skies and see.
Yes. I see a little silhouette of a mask. Got a moose, got a moose. Will you do the fandango? Thunderbolt and lightning. Very, very frightening me. Galileo, Galileo. Galileo, Figaro, Magnifico. Oh, 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 oh. I'm just a poor boy. Nobody loves me. He's just a poor boy from a poor family. Spare him this life from this monstrosity. Easy come, easy go. Will you let me go? Bismillah. No, we will not let you go. Let him go. Bismillah. We will not let you go. Let him go. Bismillah. We will not let you go. We'll not let you go. We'll not let you go. Let me go. No, 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 no. Oh, mamma mia, mamma mia, mamma mia, let me go. Beelzebub has a devil put aside. Bravo. That was absolutely amazing. Fantastic. Fantastic. Uh, beau beautiful. Like, beautiful. Whew. Um. <laughs> so, of course, three, three uh, quick things to mention. One is that he sounds like Freddy, which we have already established, which for me was even more profound and mind-blowing in this song. Secondly, he's just so talented. Like, he's a really, really, really good singer. His technique is so good. He's so precise and on point. And also, he just has the energy and the expression in his voice. I think it was just beautiful to listen to. And also, he plays the piano while he does it. And Joshua, who shared this recommendation, also shared that he spent like a week only practicing the mid piece. And I think he's just so freaking cool that he just sat down and was like, okay, I'm gonna practice and he just did it over and over and over again and he just like nailed it. Nailed it. Um yeah, my mind is pretty blown and <laughs> Yeah. You know, when I just for a brief mo for brief moments again close my eyes it, you know if somebody played this for me and I did not know it wasn't Freddy I would have thought it was just him in a live version, like literally, that is how much it sounds like him. Um, and I think it's just incredible because one thing is the voice on its own, the sound he has, the unique sound, but secondly is the technique he's able to, to um, not copy, but basically to to dive into, right, to, to use, to, to uh, practice, to emulate. I think it's just mind-blowing. It's so fascinating. It was just, uh, you know, I love the song. It's an absolute classic. And it was just such a joy to see him perform it and his take on it. Um, 
Yeah, and I'm just so thrilled that he, you know, that Mark, I don't know how, but I guess maybe he shared videos on YouTube and some people were like, oh boy, your voice sounds like Freddy, check him out, please do a cover or two of him. And then he just grabbed it, he just went for it and, you know, I think it's so freaking awesome. And I'm so grateful that he kind of came because he really puts these amazing songs to live again. Um, not because there isn't absolutely amazing covers. I know Angelina Jordan have made the most amazing cover of the song, which is um, a more down tempo version. But to kind of almost re rewatch the original one is just a pleasure and a rare one that I didn't think I would ever get the chance to to experience. So I just have to say thank you so much, Joshua, for for recommending me this. Mwah! Delicious so like oh i just love it um and please let me know what you thought about it in the comment section let me know what your thoughts are do you agree with any of what i say what's maybe your point of view and let's just have a chit chat about this gent mark mattel and also the specific cover i can't wait to hear from you and again you can join the patreon if you wish um you can also subscribe and like if you feel like it and then I hope you will just have a beautiful day and that I will see you again very soon. Thank you so much for watching. I love you.